a program in which we multiply two numbers using a repeated addition. In ARM processor, we can multiply directly two numbers, but uh, we perform this operation using repeated addition. The concept is that if we take first number R1 uh, equal to 2 and second number R2 equal to 3, then 2 and 3 multiply, we will, we will get a result R0 equal to 0, 06. So in this case, 2 is added 3 times to get the result 0, 06. So 3 is considered as a counter which we are going to subtract one time and add 0 to in R0 register from each steps. So let us take this program in detail using instructions. First, we defined our program using area program code read only entry and main in the main section we have to write our program so first instruction is used as ldr ldr is load register which register r1 register with a value 1 so this value 1 is a variable which is defined here as a 0 2 and second instruction is load register r2 with value 2 this value 2 is defined right here as 0 3 so we have to multiply 0 2 by 0 3 so in this case let us take another register r0 as a 0 0 so after that we have to add 0 0 with register r1 0 2 the first time r1 considered as 0 2 r2 is considered as 0 3 r0 is considered as 0 0 and first time r0 is added to the r1 so we will get a result 0 2 so in this instruction r0 contain the value 0 2 after that r2 is considered as a counter so it is a decremented one time hash 1 represent r2 minus 1 r2 contain the value 0 3 which is subtracted one time we will get a result of 0 2 after that we have used instruction b and e b and e branch if not equal not equal then it goes to the loop so loop is right here so but this instruction check this instruction check the register r2 if r2 is not equal to 0 then it moves toward the loop so in next instruction we will add r0 with r1 in this point of time r0 contain the value of 0 2 which is added with 0 2 and we will get a result 0 4 so at this point of time r0 hold the result 0 4 so next instruction is executing here r2 contain the value 0 2 which is subtracted by 0 1 and we will get a result 0 1 right here BNE instruction check R2 register if R2 is equal to 0 then it move to the next in this case R2 is not equal to 0 so it move further again 
R0 is added with R1. Here R0 is 4. This 4 is added with 0 2. We will get a result 0 6. So R0 contain the result as 0 6 right here. After that subtraction is performed where R2 is subtracted from 1. R2 contain the value 0 1. 0 1 minus 0 1 result will be 0 0. So branch if not equal here the instruction is true. Instruction is true. Condition is true. Means that this instruction is false. So we move toward next instruction. So in this instruction we stored the result in R3 register. So R3 register contain the result equal to R3 register contain result equal to 06. So this is our final result. So let us take an overview in Kale software where we can execute this program. So let us start by using our software. We have written our program in uh, this section. So here is the program repeated addition. So let us start from the beginning. We have initialized our program using area program code read only entry and main. The indentation of this program is very compulsory. You have to write your program in this way only. If you write your program jumbly, then there is a situation when error will be present or you have to write your program in this way only so in this program first we have defined rdr r1 register with the value 1 <coughs> but it means it means that r1 register is loaded with value 1 so value 1 is defined right here so 0 2 is loaded into r uh, value 1 so value 1 to r1 register let us take the compilation of this program and execution of this program and we will find that in first step this R1 is loaded with the value of 0 2. In the next step, R2 register is loaded with the value of 0 3. In next step, R0 is loaded with 0 0. Now, first add R0 with R1. So R1 plus R0 becomes 0 2. Now we subtract R2 as a counter and we will get result 0 2. So 0 3 minus 0 1 equal to 0 2. After that this instruction check if branch if not equal if result is not equal to 0 then it move toward the label label is loop so next we have to add again r0 with r1 so 0 2 must be added with 0 2 we will get 0 4 so this 
R0 register contain value 0, 04. Now we subtract again 0, 02 minus 0, 01. We will get 1 in R2. So this R2 contain value 0, 01. After that, we have to perform another operation because this R2 is not equal to 0. So we have to move further toward the label. So in this case, 0, 04 should be added with 0, 02 and we will get the result R0 equal to 0, 06. So this is R0 which contains result 0, 06. Then we subtract 1 minus 1. We will get the result 0 and this instruction goes to true and this BN, uh, this instruction BNE loop is not going to be executed so let's check BNE loop and this is not going to upward it moving further down so we have to store our result into R3 register so after executing this, our R3 register contain the result 06. So in this way, we can perform a repeated addition program.